But how will Daryl Green's addition to the athletic staff enhance uh, the goals of your department, and what, especially with this emphasis on you know, building that community? Right, right, right. And it's not the start of football team. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but so what Daryl's role is to um, help us sort of re-engineer uh, what, what we look at in, in athletics as our community relations uh, department and uh, to take a much more intentional uh, approach to uh, community relations vis-a-vis uh, -vis building uh, our brand, our athletic brand in, in the DMV uh, area specifically, not just here in Northern Virginia, but in, you know, across the country and whatnot, I've been to, uh, to Baltimore to help us expand our base of donors and um, ultimately to, to monetize that in such a way that again helps us to uh, support our student athletes financially and finance our growth and so helping us find new partners, new corporate partners and uh, it's a lot of fun to go with him someplace and, and we, uh, we go in competing on who's going to come back with the most business cards and uh, <laughs> fortunately he has to stop and take a lot more pictures than I do, so I can't complain that one. But, uh, but that's, his, that's his primary role, and, and certainly a secondary one is to, to help um, model uh, the kinds of behaviors that, that we want our student athletes and, and coaches to exhibit and, uh, and to communicate with our athletes. And it's just, it's so much fun to watch that communication happen. With, with our student athletes when they have a chance to uh, to communicate with him and, and to ask him questions and he just does a, a superb job and, and he's been an, uh, an, an education advocate for 30 years with, with a lot of the after school programs that he's done for inner city uh, youth and so it's uh, it's a lot of fun to see that happen and, and, but those are those are really the